From north to south, they shouted freedom and no green pass, comparing the measure to persecution by Nazi Germany. 30,000 anti-vax protesters gathered across Italy in the past few days to voice their opposition to Italy's health pass. And while the anti-vaccination front has grown in number with more rallies planned in the next few days, in the capital Rome, citizens and business owners are prepared to do whatever it takes to get back to normal. Most of the people we spoke to here in Rome are in favor of Italy's health pass and they don't seem to be bothered by the idea of using it to enter indoor restaurants, gyms or cultural venues. And most importantly, they see it as the only way to encourage vaccine hesitant people to get the jab. According to Italy's special COVID-19 commissioner, since last Thursday when the decision to introduce the new health pass was announced, there has been an increase of up to 200% in vaccine bookings. I think the Green Pass will be useful to convince undecided people to get vaccinated in order to continue doing what they normally do, something that would not be possible without the health pass. I think it's normal to see people who are against it, but but what is the point? Don't they want their lives to go back to normal? If that's the only way, I'm in favour of it. I think without a new set of rules, it would be impossible to overcome the pandemic. Myself, as well as other people, want to get their lives back. This indoor restaurant will only be able to accept Green Pass holders. It makes us feel safer to guarantee health and protection for both us and the customers. We might lose something in terms of revenues, but we can't have everything. Among those who agree with the new rules, this woman is worried her privacy could be compromised. I think it's very annoying. Why should I show everyone my personal documents? I think my privacy has gone due to COVID. The debate over the Green Pass has taken centre stage in Parliament, threatening to undermine the ruling coalition. If on the one hand, Italy's interior minister has condemned anti-vaccination rallies, the League party leader Matteo Salvini said politicians should instead respect and listen to the protesters' voices. Giorgio Orlandi, Euronews, Rome.